Here's 10 rough settings that you need to change. The first setting you're going to want to change is grass displacement, as when it's turned on it's way easier to find drop weapons on the floor. Here's what it looks like with grass displacement turned off. By default this is how weapons will look in your hand, but if you type this command in, the weapon in your hand will look smaller. This lets you see more of the screen and in my opinion just looks a lot better. On small oil rig you can find walls just like this one, but if you turn your object quality down to zero, you can see and shoot right through it. The next setting you're going to want to change has to do with your map. If you open your map and have a look around, the next time you open your map it won't be focused on your character, which can get a bit annoying, but if you go into the control settings and change the key you use for focus map on player, and you're going to want to change it to the same key that you use to open your map. Once you've done this, whenever you open your map it'll always be focused on you. The next setting you're going to want to change is optimised loading. You're going to want to make sure this is set to partial, as having this turned on makes you load into servers way quicker. The next command I've got will let you zoom in. If you type this command in, then whenever you press your mouse button, you'll be able to zoom in. This can be pretty useful for seeing stuff in the distance. Next I'm going to show you a keybind to combat log quicker. Every time you want to check your combat log, you have to type this in your console. But if you use this command, all you have to do is press one button, and you can instantly see your combat log. The next setting you're going to want to change is head lerp. This setting changes how fast you stop alt looking. As you can see when it's set to 1, it's much slower than when it's set to 100. The next setting you're going to want to change is to add some custom keybinds. Here's a few of my favourites. If you type this command in, you'll be able to craft bandages just by pressing one button. If you have a soft side and a base, type this command in, and then you only have to press one button. If you're sick of holding W, then type this command in, and you'll only have to press one button to run. If you don't want to keep toggling on your flashlight, then all you have to do is type this command in, and then whenever you aim in, the flashlight will turn on. Finally, I'd recommend setting some launch options for Rust. What you want to do is go to Rust in your Steam library, click on Properties, and this is where you can set some launch options. I'll have my launch options in the description below. And that's all the tips I've got for this video, but if you want to learn 101 Rust tips and tricks, click this video.